So another example of simultaneous equations, um, we've got lots of things going on. So they tell us they want us to find the value of d, given that a is 2, d is 2 times a, c is 5b over 2, and d is c plus 2. Well, they asked us to find d. But to find d, we have to find c. And in order to figure out c, we have to know what b is. And in order to figure out b, we have to know what a is. So it's kind of like a chain of equations that we're going to put all together. So the first step, right, we need b. Um, so we take what the value for a, and we get, plug that in. So b is 4. So I know what b is now. So now I can put 4 in for b in this equation for c. So I get 5 times 4 over 2, which gives me 20 divided by 2, which is 10. So now I know what c is. c is 10. And now I can do the last step. I can use what I got for c and put it in for d, which it was our, what we were trying to get. Um, so d equals 10 plus 2, which is 12. So that's just another example of types of simultaneous equations you can have where they all work together um, to get to one value that we're looking for.